So for those of you who are just coming to this live stream, this part one, where I was talking about all the injustices that uh, former president of Zambia, President Lungu, did to the Zambian people, and then the children, they're coming on media to cry like babies. Cry, cry, babies. They're yeah, crying. Cry, cry, cry. Looking for the sympathy of Zambians. Tell me if you can hear me, guys. Let me know. Comment if you can hear me, please. Comment if you can hear me. They came to cry today and made a press briefing uh, with their representative who was once a councillor. You can hear me now. Okay, good. Who was once a councillor uh, to come and speak on behalf of the family. Uh, and we are supposed to cry as well and sympathize. And, oh, we're not going to cry. What are we going to cry about? Tell me, what are we going to cry about when so many things happened and the Zambians were deprived of their freedom? I'm not going to feel any pity for you. And by the way, you can cry as much as you like. Nobody cares. You don't take your, your relationship of your father. You want to now bring it for the Zambian people to sympathize. Oh, eh, the first former first family, they are being what, what, the father, this and that. No, cry. In fact, you will cry. We don't even care anymore. The patriotic front made us have hearts where we became bitter where we felt like there was something that was choking us this is our country zambia but we couldn't even feel the freedom of speech freedom of walking around i remember when we were campaigning in kalikiliki we we're just having a small meeting these guys would send cadres to Ask people. I have been to Levin Wanawasa Hospital to see young men that were stabbed to death. I remember seeing one young man that was everywhere. All of just because he wore a t-shirt written Haka in the Hichilema. In fact, it was written HH. -H. You know that other label for it's like maybe hell hansen or something like that so just because it was written hh -H and it was red that was it where were you tasila lungu the lungu family where were you when the zambian people were being brutalized by your father cry far away we don't care i personally don't give a shit i don't care you understand me you can imagine a mother losing a child because the police went to control something and the stray bullet hits a child. Alec Mugala, where were you? Selfish people. Where were you? Where were you when Joseph was gunned down just because they went to render support to President Haka in the President Haka in the was being summoned all the time by the state to go for rubbish meetings. He was stopped even to fly in his own country. He became a prisoner in his country. Where were you? We don't care. We don't care. You made President Haka in the a prisoner in his own country. Somebody who could not even fly. And that's why when he flies around, I say, go on, Mr. President. You never had this freedom. Where were you? You now want to come and bring pity party and do conference. For who? Who is supposed to even entertain you? You are supposed to be focusing on your families. This is a time to bond with your father. Eat bread, Chinese, Christmas dinner, bond. Your father made mistakes that cost our country a lot. You made Hakaine Ichilema go to Mukoveko 
whilst his family didn't even know his next meal. Where were you? Today, you have the infantry to come and say, my father is now being sent as well. You are crying for who? You are crying for who? Tasila Lungu. Uli di Ravanda. Allah. Who are you crying for? And Zambians should even entertain you because you have cried. Cry. If you like cry blood. Your father made us have hearts where we, we, we felt like imagine a foreign national in our country treating Zambians anyhow. And your father never had a voice. They even made a mouse and apologize for simply correcting the Chinese. Where were you? Is it because hundreds of thousands of dollars were entering in whoever's accounts? We don't care. I personally wept at the suffering of my Zambian people. And your father promised. He said, I will make sure as soon as I'm, I've sworn in, um, I make sure that HH -H will be in prison. Your father felt like he was God. But God showed him who is bigger. God showed him that when you plan evil for tomorrow, I will teach you a lesson. He deserves it. He deserves it. President Hakaine Chilema is even kind. He is a good man. Trust me. He allows patriotic fools parading everywhere freely with money they embezzled FTJ FT Chuluba by now you would have made sure you are you are kuchalo chamaluba singing hallelujah somewhere you have the freedom now you want to come and come and give us your speeches for what we're not interested you should be advocating for your father to bring those monies that you guys were enjoying. Start giving to the poor. Start giving to the poor. Show the people of Zambia that you, your father, yes, he made mistakes. Start winning the hearts of the Zambian people. Like they're not coming with the crocodile tears. Meanwhile, you're, you've stashed them a hundred oh, millions of dollars somewhere. What about President Haka and the Ichilema's children? They couldn't even sleep. I, for one, even just my husband going to the shops and he's coming a bit late, I can't sleep. Now imagine a man is in prison, your husband of three children. You were quiet. Enjoy. I'll make sure I will break their bones. Idiots! Grade threes became in charge of our country, Zambia. Whilst graduates were chased from jobs. We had idiots, cadres, going to the council offices, going to government offices, chasing away people who are qualified just because our president, Nikada, our president, Navalanda. We had an idiot even calling. We need to find that fool. Nonsense. Thank you. You are even. 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 You are are even. You are even. You are even. You are that's how they make their money. Otherwise, they are not interested in rubbish. I don't like that. Mwale chusha mazambian. Mwazambian teta pite na fwale tisha tia redi ni shukumu lopola. How many youths have we lost? When the youths wanted to campaign, protest about what's going on, 
they were deprived of because your father felt like he was the next Idi Amin or the next Hitler. And as you are crying, have you seen Zambia and sympathize with you? It's only your fellow PF people. Zambians are not interested. Interested in what? CDF Mwaledia Mweka, Mwale Nyopola Mweka. Nefe Mwale Kula Manganda Mwale Kula Mweka. Nego Mwale Ishita Malant Mwale Ishita Mweka. Nefe Mwale Nda Mahodi de Mwale Ya Mweka. We were not there. Zambians were on minimum wage of 600 kwacha security guard. Where were you Tasila Lungu? That today you want to cry, you and your family, you are crying for who? You are even introducing yourself. This is Lungushani, Lunguhu, the wives and sons and daughters. It's not a family meeting. You are not interested. You could have had that family meeting when you had issues going on to state lodge. You should have come to express how, oh, we, there's a rumor that there's a baby here. Yeah, you should have come and talked about those things. So many rubbish things were going on. Focus on state lodge if you had a state lodge. Zambia became like a brothel. It became like a place where anybody can just come. Oh, you, this one is doing this, is doing that. And if you talk, they destroy your business. They destroy everything. I just came to say, Tasila Lungu, we are not interested in your drama, in your cries with your family. We don't care whether you cry or not. We're not interested. It was a very good show. You should actually apply to go and act in uh, Mpali. They need actors. People suffered. Even up to now, Zambians, they are suffering. And you can imagine... Uh, President Haka in Ichilama inheriting a very disorganized Changanya kind of arrangement. Of course, we want to see change now. It's not easy. He's even trying. We were in a state of emergency where we had to get rid of a government which you, as a councillor, were enjoying the detriment of the Zambian people's welfare. Don't have time for you. Mwane nyo pola mwe koko. Uko. Mwapanga nama wedding. Classic. Naba sungu. Mwane rida. Go and enjoy your memories. Zifo mwane shi nyo pola inda nama. We're not interested. Ala. But yama Zambian zema mwane kwa takwada. What am I trying to say? In life, it is a lesson to everybody. You never know tomorrow. When you have it, be humble. When you don't have it, be humble. And when you are in leadership, be someone that is fair. Don't wait till your father is in that situation. They want to come and speak. Anyway, good night, Zambians. I'm waiting for some people. They are fixing some things in the house. They are packed to push it. They are just making noise. Sympathy. Me, I will personally make sure. I saw today at Brian Mundubide, the future of Zambia. Ah! Ati! So Zambians will vote for PF again. Hey! It can never happen. Not in this life. Maybe in the next life. Cut.
icona. <laughs> na mama vota no vota ti tre vote la green. Iye timwanya no kunyia. Ava ah, mi pingira kuti tukaba mwana nga twabwela pofi. Ha! Given Lovinda the way he was behaving today, given Lovinda is that he was celebrating his birthday in prison. He, he given Lovinda he celebrating his birthday in prison. And we should feel sorry. we should feel sorry for who? Who? And then what should happen? Yes, he's our uncle, he's our daddy. But sir, you were very cruel. These people were very cruel. We were now thinking we're going to join the history of those people who've experienced a war in their countries. You understand? Somebody said, she's fatter than me. She failed. I failed to be MP, blah, 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 blah. We all can be MPs, mate. Everyone has their season. And she's not smarter than me. And she will never, never be president of Zambia. Never. Why? Are people blind? Allah. Allah. <laughs> so, ah, I, I pretty. No, I'm not going to go to the Ati tayari saying PF will be back in power. He's just saying it, Kairi. If somebody pays you to talk, live stream, you will talk. This is different. Me, I don't, nobody pays me. I just come on my live stream and I talk my, my, my mind. I speak. PF will bounce to which power? In what capacity? full of selfish people. Zambia became like a brothel. We had, yeah, there's a word I don't want to use because it describes women in another way. But we had women, slay queens, who would even, ah, I can't even explain. They were running things in Zambia. Whilst you, with your degree, you are suffering, you are fasting, you are praying, you are in church. Pale oko. PF chari poa. 2026, HH will become president of Zambia because the alliance will fight. That's prophecy. 2031, we are coming. The younger generation, we are coming. Last time for PF. Ghost workers, they were plenty. So many of them on salary. And do you know, even NAPSA, that the president has said people should be receiving, is it 20% of the NAPSA amount? Council workers have never received a penny because the government was never remitting the funds. They were deducting but never paying. Who was collecting that money? Oh, disorganized bunch. I know President Lungu's family, former President Lungu's family. They are suffering. One of them, we even brought her, she's in the UK working now. Your uncle is a president. He can't even give you a slice of bread. So you, a Zambian, you expected this man to help. No. Me, I was even shocked to find that you people have selected President Lungu. Who is this man? The man can't even make a speech. Go and see on YouTube. On Tunacheki channel. President Hakainde Ichilema's speeches are all over. At least he talks sense. Like I said, he may not be perfect. But he is at least representing Zambia well. Better. The president... When he would speak, I wouldn't even understand what he said. What is this man talking about? He didn't even give a shit about Zambia. He didn't care. Hey, Abomba, Papuato, Amarodi, Amashani. What? Are Zambians going to eat roads? Are Zambians going to eat um, uh, uh, bridges? Ah, there's that bridge on Kalingalinga Road. Yeah, that bridge, I hate it. It doesn't even make sense. Zadembi Sipadia.
um, uh, where former you is it you and is still there? That place where there's that no ah, ah what is that? They were launching it, and people went to even watch, and to launch it, it cost is it twenty million watcher to launch? A rubbish, my rubbish, yeka yeka jabe. Allah. Tasila and your family stay in your lane. Uko kwe noko. Don't abuse the human rights that President Echicha said you are entitled to a figure of speech. You are entitled to speak. Then number one say, na mu pam pamina nem pam pamina na mu mu ai kope kama fara nama suit. At we are coming to give a a a speech. Speech of who? Ha! Hey. Aho kwe na kwa ribechi wele shiku zambia. Iye. Umutu nwa wa opposition. You even have the guts to come and hear me my father. Eh. Hey. You made the diaspora raise funds. Because the locals, they were, their businesses were being stopped. By your father. He was stopping businesses. If they just know that this one, he likes HH, they cut his businesses. They make sure transportation, everything they are doing. You made us to leave the diaspora. Mavis is even watching. We had to be the ones fund. We were doing shift. We were cleaning toilets to make sure HH is president. Then you, you want to come. President HH, you are being too nice to these people. You are being too nice. These people now are going to say Allah. Why is that not with that? By the state, they are mistreating. Mistreating your father, what? How? When HH was in Mukubeko, why didn't you talk? Freedom of speech, you know, by the HH, uh, boss, reduce the volume. What a family meeting, what a press briefing. briefing, briefing. I said, I'm going to address the people of Zambia. Don't listen to those people. They are manipulators. They are fake. They are manipulators. If they had good hearts, they would have told their father to do the right thing. Have you ever seen when President HH is president now that any idiot has risen up to say, Hey! And they'll be threatening you. Nobody. He said you're on your own. Allah. Just focus on eating family dinner. Uko Sunday roast. Yava sungu balanda. Mune idiafi oko. Mwaisha. Mwashimika kono tushimi. Don't bring us. Fia mwa family matters. Mune de tapa Facebook. Ah ah. More paper, no paper. Yay! Oh, but let's ah, God. God, no, you're merciful. You, they even prayed before they. You are praying that what? Ah! Hey! You even had a prayer. Prayer. Before the, the speech. And then the representative spoke. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> you are the ones who even made us even Zambians think prayer is is something you use to abuse Zambians. Because you even brought the 18th October to pray. Yes, it's a good idea. But you abused you abused it. You can see even the King's Malemba has dumped your father after buying him a land cruiser. He's dumped your father. You made a gospel artist to become a kada. To be insulting people, to be calling them satanists, to be insulting men of God. Hey, and you are even praying. Hey, God, you are merciful. Shameless people. You want to break Haka in the HLMA's house and you are crying. <laughs> Just because they came to your house to collect a car, a smoker, which they did not break your gate. 
And who is paying for rent? It's the state. Uh-oh. -uh. They have every right to enter now. Hmm. <laughs> yeah. I saw all of them. You know about Palanameka Beka? Oh, Palanameka Beka. You know about Palanameka Beka? You know about Palanameka Beka? You know about Palanameka Beka? You know about Chula? Huh? And they couldn't even speak for the Zambian people. Today, they want to come and speak for their father. Hey! Lord have mercy. Hey! I see that you family in America. I see that you know about I see that you know about it. I see that you but my sister, we don't care. <laughs> Iwe, me, I will never care. But if I don't go in a family, I will. Never. Me, Timisha, Kosa, she be. My brother skipper. You were never brother skipper, sister skipper. Lero, Ati. <laughs> La Chwerish Big Pretenders Palana How many are you, Papa? I just said I just talked to you, my Zambian people. I don't take any nonsense from these people, they are just looking for attention. But mm -hmm. so I was fooling. I told him to come to school. He was They are the ones who even made me when I'm entering Zambia. I sneak in as if I'm running away. Ah, ah. My own country. To enter, I would sneak in. Because I'm scared of Bowman. I'm scared of Camp Campiongo. Even deported Larry Muita, a Zambia. A Zambian citizen arrives, you send directives that he should be deported. Pastors, they were arriving, you were sending directives that they should be deported. They just want your money. They just want your money. At voting secret. Anyway, guys, take care. I love you. Don't allow people to fool you. Yeah? Marabish. We are being mistreated. My father. Kula ya kwa tizambia ya wai. Ay, gadis. Alla kadidida nukutaduko. We're not interested. Mayro kukui nukutaduko. Alla. 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 Chibirish.